Hey everybody, we're going to do a super quick video on PNF and PNF patterns, specifically looking at D1 flexion and extension, D2 flexion and extension of the upper extremity. So first, just important to remember that flexion of the shoulder would be going up and then extension of the shoulder is going back. So for D1 patterning, our D1 flexion, we're crossing the midline, we're creating a fist, we have a little external rotation of the shoulder, adduction of the arm, and then here, our D1 extension, right, we've extended our arm, we're internally rotating and we're ab abducted. Flexion, extension, D1. What activity might you do here? Functional activity, maybe brushing your hair. Here in your extension, I like to think about closing the car door back behind me. So I've exited my car um, from the driver's side and then I take the car door and close it behind me. So that's our D1 patterning. D2, I like to think about a sword. So D2, I'm in D2 extension when I'm crossed over, internal rotation, adduction, and then my flexion, I've lifted, I've abducted, and I'm externally rotated. I'm taking my sword and pulling it up. What activity might you do down here? Um, maybe you're zipping up uh, the side of a dress or pants. Up here, I think about putting something on a high shelf. Now for this sword action, for our D2 extension to flexion, there's an activity that many of us may do that incorporates these two pieces. I like to think about taking things out of the dishwasher. So if my dishwasher is over here and my shelf is up here, what do I do? I bend over, especially if I'm right-handed. I'm gonna bend over, grab my dish. So here I am in my D2 extension because I've adducted, internally rotated. I'm grabbing my dish and then here I go. I extend and abduct and put it on the shelf. 